So, Bill, you get your first big leadership position with the Giants, looking back with 25 years of perspective, were you ready at that moment for, for the calling of becoming a head coach? No. The answer was no. I didn't expect it at that moment. I had aspired to be that way. But my first year I really wasted because I was trying to be what, quote, I thought a head coach was kind of supposed to behave like. I was behaving like what I kind of thought a head coach was supposed to behave like. And I really wasn't being myself. And that was very, very costly, almost cost me any opportunity to ever continue coaching as a head coach in the NFL. Actually, basically, for all intents and purposes, I was fired if they could have found the right replacement. But fortunately, I don't know why God was looking down on me, the man they chose to be the right replacement didn't really want the job at the time. So they really didn't have the recourse, and they said, okay, we're going to give this guy another year. Well, when I found, I knew all about this scenario as well. So when I found that out, I said, well, okay, if I'm going down with this ship, we're going to do it my way from now on. And I changed my whole attitude, but the basic thing I changed was back to being Bill Parcells. And I think that's what really eventually got me started. It's a great lesson for everyone in the room. Rule number one is be yourself. Be yourself. And, and I don't want to rehash a bad year, but the year happened was, was 3-12 and 1. You, you decided, we won all but 12. You, <laughs> you, we you, don't say 3-12, we won all, all but 12. 